Okay, so I'm gonna let Kelly explain to you about grinding because he's got a method that he uses when you grind the tire and which way you grind the tire. Okay, so on a right rear tire, the edges that we're looking for, for our traction would be, is the front leading edge of a right rear tire and the outside edge of the right rear tire. So on the beadlock side, them are what we call our drive edge tires. The front of that drive edges, the outside edge of the edges. So them are the tires when, we want it, when we're working on a tire and we're trying to grind a tire, we wanna sharpen them edges up and, and or not destroy them edges. So when you're looking at a grinder that turns clockwise, the, the biting edge, you wanna go against the non-drive edge tires. So on a right rear, so this is our right rear tire. Our drive edges of our tires that we're looking for traction are on the front side and the outside edge. So you would stand on the beadlock side as a grinder is grinding. It's coming across the non-edge that you're not so concerned about and going away from your drive edges, which is the front and the outside edge. So if it tears up this inside edge a little bit, that's okay. As long as you don't tear up the front edge and the outside edge. I watch people just ruin brand new tires. If you were to have a, a real aggressive pad and stand on this side, you're coming across, what are you doing? You're knocking off your sharp edge here and your sharp edge there. So beadlock side, stand on the beadlock side on a right rear, right front. Just the opposite on the left rear. Your left rear, your drive edges are where? Inside edge, same front edge. If you were to stand on this side, it's gonna tear up them edges. Stand on this side, you're going away from them edges. You'll see it when you grind one if it's wrong. You're looking at the edges and all of a sudden the edges are rounded. Eh, that's not as good as if they're nice and sharp. You're almost doing like a feather effect. And you're taking and the you're feather. feathering it to the edge. Feathering to the edge. And especially if you got that little feather, when you sand the top of the feather off, you sand the top of the feather off on that side and go away from your drive edge edges. So your drive edges are the front and the inside on the left rear, left front. But understand that? Did I explain it good enough? Okay, so you got your, this type, particular tire here, it's got the feather edge. Okay, so this more than likely, no question, was a right rear tire. So you would stand on the beadlock side and grind that feather edge off. Grinders grinding this way. Mm -hmm. So now we're trying to, what we're trying to achieve with sanding a tire, not only are we trying to take the glaze off the tire, but we're trying to sharpen up them little edges on the drive edge tires. American racer tires, you run American racers. So when you're, when you're grinding and we can regroove them, so you regroove to the drive edges of your tires. So we can actually take the American racer and groove that and square up and make them sharp drive edges back sharp again. Poor man's new tire. Very important. I watch people ruin tires grinding them. So.